Carol. All right, let's uh, go to Simon now with the business. Recession is surely a bad time to launch a new venture, or is it? Some brave souls are trying. They are. You'd think that the recession was the enemy of the entrepreneur, but open some of the newspapers this morning, and you'll see Richard Branson saying there's never been a better time to be the new him. Today, we also see the publication of a new book, The Bright Idea Handbook, which aims to tell us how to turn our ideas into a profitable reality. Well, here's one person uh, who managed to take advantage of the downturn to launch his big idea. So my name's Rob Law, I'm director of Magmatic and also go by the name of Trunky's Daddy. We've had quite our fair share of significant hurdles, I think um, failed licensing deals, we've had um, factories go bust out in China, um, we had to, in this particular case, the Chinese government come in and seize all the equipment in the factory including my very expensive moulds that make the beloved Trunkies. When we got into the new factory we had to rush, rush the production and we had a few teething problems. Um, one or two slight issues with quality and then um, when we overcame those we were then looking to hit the summer of 2006 quite strong and then terrorist threats meant hand luggage restrictions and you couldn't take trunkies into the airport. Obviously you've got to be very thick skinned, you've got to uh, appreciate or understand that you can have some significant hurdles to overcome because success just doesn't come that easily um, but really I guess one of the things I'd like to sort of put across really is that despite the media saying we're everyone's tightening their belts we're in a credit crunch so it gives you lots of opportunities as well so I set up Magmatic in uh, sort of 2003 and at the tail end of the last slowdown where I can actually find a full-time job as a product designer and it gave me the opportunity to start up my own business. Well, that was, uh, that was uh, Rob Law, the uh, ma maker of the Trunky. Now, this is the Bright Idea Handbook. The man who wrote it can join us now. Michael Gardner from the uh, Solicitors Wedlake Bell. Michael, um, how tough is it to launch in a recession? Why would you want to do that? Well, I think the thing about recessions is that they make you concentrate your mind. Um, if you lose your job, if you're unfortunate enough to be made redundant, you may have to think about a change of career. If you're still in a job, you may have to uh, think to yourself, why am I working harder than ever for, for less reward? So it's a good time, I think, to concentrate your mind on starting something different. So necessity, the mother of invention in some ways. So. If you've got a great idea, what's the first thing you should do? Well, I think the first thing you have to do is be very careful not to tell people about your idea, because a lot of people will go and blurt that out. Their idea may be copied before they've had a chance to do anything with it. Or if it's an invention, you might literally ruin your chances of getting protection for it if you tell anyone. OK, and that's presumably the first thing that you want to do. And then after you've done all that, you're going to need some money. I mean, where's money going to come from? The banks are having trouble lending. Uh, uh, redundancy packages, maybe? Redundancy packages would be one thing. But I think you, if you look around at the moment, we've got interest rates down at near uh, zero for deposits. We've got property prices still falling. Shares are all over the place. Pensions don't look very good, judging by my last pension statement anyway. So there are lots of um, risky places to put your money. So investing in a new business opportunity may not be so risky. Not a bad idea to, to put it into that if, if all the other options aren't looking so great. Precisely. Thank you very much indeed. So uh, I was actually talking to the guy I got my bacon sandwich for and I said to him, I'm doing a piece saying that it's a good time for to launch a business. He said it's a very good time to try and squeeze your landlord. That's what he said to me. I don't know if the landlords will thank me for saying that, but that was his advice. <laughs> no, 